So, I escaped Lynchburg, Virginia temporarily. I'm down here to watch Duke play North Carolina. And since my uncle went to Duke, I'm rooting for Duke. I met a friend of mine, my college roommates. So we're in the town of Cary, and this is the White Oak Creek Greenway. And uh, I just thought I'd get the, the beginning of the trail here on the, on the map. See, there's the bikes down there. And uh, it's just gonna be a quick 40-minute uh, hike. Imagine here in Cary, there's gonna be a lot of people on the trail. But uh, isn't this beautiful? I tell you, man, what a treasure that my uh, college roommate has nearby his house. I mean, I only walked five minutes to get here. I mean, you know, this is awesome. And uh, so we're gonna go down this trail and then we're gonna go to a beer something or other. I, I wanna say beer garden, but that's not the name of the place. And then uh, there's a, we have a reservation. The game's at eight o'clock tonight, but I just wanted to show you the Cary, North Carolina Greenway in case you're ever here in uh, Cary, North Carolina. And uh, boy, it's, uh, it's, it's, what a treasure. This is, uh, is going to be an outstanding hike. I'm just glad to be out of Lynchburg, Virginia, at least, even if it's temporary. But uh, soon I'll be out uh, for quite some time heading back to Florida. And I've got a seven mile hike. I always like to promote my videos coming up. There's going to be a, because I got to go to the, um, got to go to the to Toyota dealer actually to get an oil change and, uh, and then have them look, because uh, my tire pressure gauge came back on again. Boy, look over here, isn't that in, that, that's kind of crazy, isn't it? So, um, so anyway, I'm going to get a selfie here in just a second. I'm just kind of looking at the ground. I mean, we are in the heart of uh, Cary, North Carolina, and this, this is what all cities need to do. You know, I mean, Lynchburg's got their, their the Blackwater Creek Trail there, but, uh, you know, it's, it's very important to preserve these natural areas uh, and so um, I'm just going to enjoy hiking uh, for about 40 minutes. It sounds like it's going to take me. We're going to go onto the interstate. I'll get that. Um, and of course, I hit a doggone toll road. I, I keep telling the stupid phone not to put me on toll roads. And uh, who knows? I got to get on the computer and see if I've got enough money in my SunPass account to pay the toll. But look over here. Isn't that amazing? Pretty impressive. All right. So let's... Uh, if I see anything unique, uh, we'll cut the video back on. But man, I tell you, what a beautiful day it is here. I'm in Cary, North Carolina, and I'm glad that I'm out on this bike trail. I, you know, I asked my, because I, you know, when you sit in the car for, well, it took me about two and a half, three hours to get here. You know, I just all I want to do is just get out and stretch my legs, and you know, my stick, my stick is hiking for sure. And uh, boy, this is this is quite beautiful. I can't, I didn't imagine that I would be on a bike trail this close to my, uh, my college roommate's house. And, uh, boy, I tell you, it was, it was fun. He's got two dogs and, uh, boy, they were jumping all over me. I haven't had a, I haven't had dogs that excited in quite some time. Of course, I love my dog and I did call my uh, ex-wife on the way down and, uh, she said she's going to let me see the dog. So I, I figured that's, uh, so when I get back to Florida, I'll actually get to spend a couple days with the dog. Um, I don't plan on making video about that, but because uh, you know I can't take him places that are new. Well, look up here. There's a seat to seat in. You know I always point those out on the videos, and uh, so you know I tell you it's uh, this is great. All right, well, if I see something new, I'll, I'll get a. We're gonna get a selfie here in a minute, and uh, this is uh, quite exciting. Quite exciting to be here in Cary, North Carolina, for the big game. I, I, by the way, I'm rooting for Duke, you know, like I said, my uncle went there and uh, so I'm not, I'm not a North Carolina fan. Uh, you know, I wish it was, uh, well, what, what would have been the dilemma is uh, NC State. If it was NC State, then, uh, then I'd have a problem because my brother was a huge, huge NC State fan. And uh, anyway, let's, let's cut the video off there. Well, I guess it's perfect timing here in Cary, North Carolina. <clears throat> Look at the leaves coming in on the trees and look at these evergreens to the right. Man, this is one heck of a nice uh, biking trail. I am thoroughly enjoying this and man, talk about nailing the weather. I guess by the time I get back to Florida, it's gonna be hotter than hell. But uh, anyway, it is what it is. By the way, I just uh, update on my mom, which I don't usually do in like hiking videos, but uh, I got everything done. You know, I sent off the last letter to um, American Express to cancel her credit card, and then she was had dental insurance, and I found out where to send a letter to Delta Dental along with my power of attorney, and 
So that's canceled too. So I'm kind of, uh, this is it. Oh, here goes the jogger, look at that. Man, I remember the day when I could do that. <laughs> He's waving at you. All right, you guys, peace out. Stay free, man. Stay free. Be good to get back to the free state of Florida. Yes, indeed. So I thought you'd want to see this. Uh, look what we're coming up on. We're going underneath, the, I think this is 540. Boy, isn't that beautiful. I tell you what, man. Carrie's got the money, don't they? Holy moly. What a treasure. What a treasure this trail is. I'm thoroughly enjoying the hike. In fact, I wish I could hike longer, but it's only going to be about 45 minutes, according to my uh, my buddy here in Cary. But look at this. I mean, that's that's uh, that's a lot of work. Let's look at uh, per Perma Trek Concrete Boardwalk built in 2012. There you go. Still looks like brand new, doesn't it? Look at look at the highway up here. Isn't this great? Oh my goodness! I tell you what, life is good. Life is good. Good to be free, people. Hey, you Democrats, be sure to move to, uh, you know, North Carolina. I mean, not North Carolina, excuse me, that's where I'm at. You know, make sure you get out of North Carolina and go to California or New York, you know. That, that way you can wear six masks and uh, enjoy your lockdowns and, uh, you know, your high taxes. Anyway, this is, isn't this astounding? I mean, look at the art. Can you imagine that mankind can build stuff like this? I think it's just amazing that, that you know, because, I mean, this is just one example that, you know, of what we're capable of as a race, the human race. So anyway, that's, uh, look, look, let's look out over the, uh, the swamp here. Isn't that beautiful? Man, oh man, I tell you, I, sometimes you gotta stop and smell the roses. Look at that. Even though it's under a bridge. All right, let's just keep going. If we're gonna try to get this on the video, look at that creek rolling by. Kind of rolls right, right through here. See it going? Isn't that awesome? By the way, I, you know, for a purple state, I haven't seen anybody with cellophane on their head or 16 masks. I guess, uh, you know, maybe, uh, maybe North Carolina is uh, a free state now. I don't know. I mean, I, I, I'm surprised that, but, you know, I'm just out hiking. You know, even, even in Lynchburg, Virginia, I see uh, people uh, walking down the trail with masks on. But I haven't seen any here yet, so let's keep going. So I wanted to get this as I walk by. I'm just gonna hold the camera out to the side. Look at all the green leaves coming in. I guess it's springtime here in North Carolina, huh? Isn't that, a, isn't that beautiful? You know, thank God we all preserve some natural areas. You know, I, I, everybody wants that Green New Deal. Well, p folks, this is the Green New Deal. This is what we have to do as a, as a, as a, as a nation and as, as people. Well, we don't need to invite a gazillion immigrants across because that they'd probably tear all this down i mean you know but uh it looks like to me that the country's doing pretty good look look at the green over here isn't that beautiful man i tell you i'm enjoying this hike this is awesome boy if you're used to washington dc you're not going to fit in here in north carolina everybody keeps waving at me <laughs> hell even in lynchburg because a lot of those people moved down from washington dc but look because, yeah, you get in an elevator in Washington, D.C., nobody speaks to each other. Here in North Carolina, everybody wants to, to uh, say hi. Not used to that, but look look at what we're walking through now. This is pretty cool, man. I mean, I'm telling you, I, I, we're going across a bridge. Man, I tell you, this is a lot of construction on this thing. But look over here. Isn't that, a, isn't that fantastic? I mean, right in the heart of Cary, North Carolina, who would have ever thought you'd have something like this, a treasure like this? So, boy, I tell you, I'm enjoying the heck out of this hike. This is awesome. This is, boy, I tell you, it's a perfect end to a trip. And of course, I'll be back in Florida here within a week. Here's some people up ahead of me. Look how long the bridge goes. Holy moly. I got, well, I guess I'm just kind of hiking over, a, well, kind of a swampy type area, I guess. But uh, boy, I can't imagine the amount of money it took to build this bridge. Well, let's catch up to these people and uh, look look at the size of this bridge. Oh my goodness. Now, you know, I will tell you this. If I were, if I were to, I'd put a picnic table right there, you know, cause it widens out right here. You know, I, I, I don't know. I don't know why they, they, they got that nice wide area. And uh, you know, it seems like to me, and especially, especially have a little canopy so that if you did get caught out here in the rain, 
you know, I always talk about that. By the way, lots and lots of uh, benches. You always talk about that, that in the bathrooms. I'm always looking for the bathrooms, but lots of benches to sit on. Uh, none of them had shelter though. That's uh, one, one disadvantage, but uh, anyway, what a hike, huh? Look at this. Oh my goodness gracious. Who would have thought, who would have thought? As I come to the end of this giant bridge, once again, I, know I put a picnic table right there, but I just wanted to see, let you look back and then we got some birds flying overhead here. What a day. All right, so I guess I'm at the end of the, uh, the swampy bridge here. Uh, boy, I tell you, I, I wish I had a bicycle. Uh, maybe I'll rent one while I'm here. And because uh, I, I don't know how many miles this thing goes, obviously I'm not gonna get to hike it in the brief period of time I'm gonna be here. I'm, on, I'm only here for the uh, March Madness. So, uh, you know, or April Madness, I guess I should say now, the final four. So, uh, and then I'll be heading back to Lynchburg and then back to Florida, baby, back to Florida, the free state of Florida under the great leadership of Governor DeSantis. Now all I know is I'm hiking to a bar somewhere for some beer and we got a right hand turn here. I don't know if this is the one I'm supposed to take. I, I guess I'll have to call my college roommate and find out. But look at this. We're coming up on another bridge. At least I'm going to hike across this even if I have to hike back. But uh, boy, this is, uh, this is outstanding. Well, talk about a different look. Look at that. Holy moly. That is kind of insane, isn't it? And another bridge going across all of this. But uh, I don't know. I mean, I thought it was supposed to be a road from what I saw. I guess I can pull the, he did put it on my GPS. So I'll pull the phone out here in a minute and take a look and, uh, and see if that's uh, what I'm, if that was the turn I was supposed to take. It, but it doesn't seem like I'm 40 minutes into the hike. I don't know. You know, you get into these hikes and you just, you're having so much fun. You know, it's uh, the time just ticks right off. That's why I love hiking. All right, so uh, let's just keep going and then I'll pull the phone out here in just a second. So look here on the Greenway, Maine to Florida, <laughs> Lincoln Cities. We got a little bit of a left turn here. I don't know where that would go. I know I'm supposed to meet him at the bar. Look at there, it just kind of goes underneath the bridge. Well, I don't know, maybe I'm coming up. It said eight minutes. I'm coming up on a road. I, I got to pull the phone out and figure out if this is where I'm supposed to be or not. <clears throat> so nothing, nothing like being out on an adventure, huh? Look at the cars parked there. What a treasure this is. I have a feeling I'm supposed to make that left-hand turn back there, but I'm gonna, I'm gonna look at the phone and see if uh, this is where I'm supposed to be to get to the, uh, the bar where I'm meeting my, um, my right college roommate. Right under yeah, right. Carolina 1600. So let's look at what my college roommate buddy did. <laughs> I have no idea. I'm in the middle of an intersection. There goes a Prius. Hey, that was a Prius Prime, I think. Boy, I tell you. But look here, I guess I did just, uh, phone told me to make a left here. I Maybe this is the place I'm going to up here. I'm just hiking along the road. But uh, boy, I tell you, I hope we get back out on that bike trail. That that was awesome. But uh, and there's a, the parking area over here. Now we could come down here and park, I guess, and uh, and pick it up where we left off. But you can see there's a, there goes a bike rider. Now, you know, I know that these bike riders, you know, they think that they're invincible. I would not ride on a road. I, I've, I've known some people that have been killed. All it takes is a drunk driver or an old person not paying attention, and boom, that guy's a dead man, you know. But uh, anyway, I, I understand. You gotta get to the bike trail somehow. All right, let's keep going. Well, since Easter's coming, let's get the rabbit on the video. Check him out. Let's see how close I can get before he takes off. Seeking up, there he goes, there he goes. All right, here comes Peter Cottontail. Oh, gotta hang up. So I found a little <clears throat> side trail. And uh, you know me, I always like to get off and check out the duck out there. And then there's one right there. I guess that, man, what a house to have here in Cary, North Carolina. That's somebody's yard up there. I just, looks like the path goes on this way. <clears throat> I didn't see any signs posted for private property, but I imagine they're around here somewhere. I just thought I'd come over here and take a quick look. It looks like there's kind of a, a bridge here. Huh. There's a pipe here. 
and I see some bicycle tracks so maybe people take their bikes through here I don't know but I think I'm not going any further I'm not gonna get my feet all wet so but that's a cool little stream look they got a little uh, cross over here boy what a piece of property and this well there's all kinds of little bridges I guess maybe they did that for the house up there man that is cool a little close to the highway though a lot of car noise all right let's get back on the paved trail well i want to get this on the video this is the uh, white oak creek greenway conservation project an amazing wetland carter it's uh let's read the sign real quick the white oak creek conservation project was classified as high priority habitat for the protection in the 2001 open space plan this project is part of a larger reparation corridor that connects to jordan lake now i'll let you read the rest of that i can pause the uh, video right there and then you've got uh well i've you are here so let's get over to the bigger map well actually it's not that much bigger so here you can see it comes along here goes under we go went under 540 and now i'm getting ready to go under uh, highway 55 so let, let's get over here and look at this sign <clears throat> so this is uh the white oak greenway <clears throat> so once again we're right here and uh i don't know if it would end at this uh because I got on somewhere back in here, I don't know, that doesn't really tell you the roads. Um, so it looks like it just ends at the American, I wonder what the American Tobacco Trail is. If that's another trail, be pretty cool if it was. So uh, anyway, let's, uh, let's keep on going. Maybe we'll get to the end of this thing today. I don't know, doesn't really say on here. I mean, the conservation area is 350 acres, but it doesn't say, uh, let's back up just a little bit so you can see the whole thing. You can pause the video right there if you're curious about the trail. So let's, uh, let's keep on going. We're getting ready to get on where I was yesterday uh, and uh, go under 55 and then, um, I think that's 55 up there. And then we'll, uh, we'll get some more video when, when we get on the other side there underneath the, the highway. Well, I wanted to get this little waterfall on the video. Isn't that pretty cool? There's a little little running stream for coming out of the uh, the swamp here. We just hiked across that, and then we're coming up. And so the uh, yesterday when I came, uh, you know, I just took this on over to the road, and then there's a bar right down there with all kinds of different beers, and uh, that's where we went and had a beer. And uh, so today I'm making this left hand turn, and uh, we're just going to continue on the. Uh, well, they call it the east coast of the uh, of the Greenway. So this is kind of what it looks like. Uh, really beautiful hike. Uh, you know, one thing I, I don't really understand, you know, and well, I mean, I guess I could. I don't know how much the, the, of the land that the city owns, but it would be cool if they put in some mountain bike trails back here. All right, let's not get any faces on the video.